everyone, today we are going to continue our Let's Play series on Thomas Was Alone. We have finished 0.1 where it's literally just Thomas, so he really was alone, but we're going to move on to 1.1. Alright, so let's jump straight into it. I'm going to try not to talk too much over the narrator this time, but he does talk at unspecified times, so I'm sorry if I do talk over him. Ah, we now have two characters to play with. Thomas is no longer alone. Alright, so now we have two characters. We have Thomas, who is the red rectangle, and we have Chris, who is the small orange square. So this is where the puzzle element starts to come into the game. Because if we take uh, Chris here, we need to get him into our... Square on the other side, but that we have this obstacle in the way and we can jump with Chris But he cannot jump high enough So we must use Thomas to allow Chris to get over to the other side So we'll switch to Thomas using the Q key on the keyboard and jump over this obstacle And we'll get Chris and we'll jump straight over the obstacle and put him into his portal Nice and simple for now Right now we have Chris again So we now need to jump out. Oh. <laughs> so let's check where Thomas is now. Let's have a look. Alright, he's all the way down here by uh, Chris's square. Right, let's just get Chris as far as we can. So we'll have to jump over these pools, past the respawn point, and up these steps. Ah, right, we can't get Chris past this obstacle, so we need Thomas to the rescue. Super Thomas. <laughs> if I can get up here. Maybe not. Up oh, this one. Ah! It's a little bit trolly. Right, let's get over. Right, let's get... Let's get Chris up here then. Give him a helping hand. Right, and now all he needs to do is fall down here. Fantastic. Right, now let's just get Thomas over. Hey, there we go. Right. Hmm. There's no platform up there though for them. Quite right. Ah, create some steps. Alright, so Chris can't get up here, so let's move him out of the way and give uh, Thomas a bit of love. Okay, so if we switch to crit, right. Okay, we're gonna have to make room for Thomas. Ah, that's how it's done. Alright, pop him there and him there. There we go. What have we got here? Hmm, okay, right. Thomas can't jump quite that high. Uh, let Chris help him. Chris is stuck! Come on, there we go. Alright, let's drop him down. And bring Chris with us as well. Probably a brighter idea. There we go. 
Oh, maybe not. <laughs> not too far. Not far enough. Okay. Hey, there we go. What level are we on now? 1.5. Right, so it was all the obvious observation that Thomas was doing was great as well. Every time they saw something that they knew, Chris would be a satisfaction. Alright, so Chris obviously could not jump over that. Alright, let's go back to Chris quickly. And get him off. Fantastic, right. Alright, we probably don't want Chris falling down there. Can he, can he make it? Ah, he can, right. Alright, that, that's a job for Chris. I just love the simplicity of this game. It, it, it's so simple, yet it's quite addicting. Okay, now we need to get Thomas over here. Right, let's go up here. Oh, I hate these things. I, I I can always remember them in Sonic the Hedgehog. On the Marble Zone level. <laughs> and always falling into the lava. It was quite tremendous. And infuriating at the same time. Uh, <gasps> that was so lucky. Okay. Oh. Now we have three. Right, this is part three to uh, Thomas Was Alone. So. Oh, right, we now have three characters. Three lovely, lovely characters. One very tall one. We have Chris and we have Thomas. I didn't catch the tall one's name, but I'm sure I'll pick it up. So, um, right, this, we need to get them, can, can Chris, can Thomas jump with, no, okay. So we need, we need to, can, wait, hold on, can Thomas move with Chris on him? Ah, he can. Okay, so we need to get, uh, we'll put this long stick there and we'll get, Chris up there, and then we'll get Thomas up there. And there we go. This would be good. John needed room to show off his exceptional skills. But it was he was trapped the wrong side of his long things. Right, we can't get uh, Chris or Thomas. Past John, that's his name. So we're gonna gonna have to move John out the way. Ah, just the trick. Let's get Thomas over there. Chris over there. And we'll get John over here. Nice and simple. Think, um, I don't think John's gonna get it. Not Chris. No, Thomas is gonna get over there. Nope. So we're gonna have to use John. Fantastic. Did see a little white button up here somewhere. There it is.
Alright, let's get Chris over there. Ah, oh, okay. We need Thomas to the rescue. Okay, Thomas again. And again. Right, now where next? Let's go down here. Hmm. Right, yeah, we're going to need Thomas. So let's not take him any further. Geronimo! Fantastic. Alright, let's butt him up against the wall. Him through there. So yeah, these levels are getting progressively harder. Alright, okay. John might come in handy. <laughs> Not stuck on the wall though. Ah! Ah, brilliant. There we go. We're getting somewhere. 1.9. Ignore what I said about the second part earlier. I think I'm going to stick to doing 0.1 and then 1.1 and then 2.1 rather than splitting them up into introducing new characters. Right, so now we need to get this uh, button pressed. <laughs> I think we're going to need all three to do this, so let's sort this out. Let's get John down there. No, you know what? I'm going to I'm gonna pop... Hmm. Let's get John there. Pop Thomas there, and then get John to jump up. John. Okay. Chris can't jump high enough. Hmm, that ain't gonna work. How? How are we gonna do this? Is there anything up here that's going to help? No. <laughs> right, that was a waste of time. Maybe I'm just being really dumb right now. Um, actually, hold on. If I, if I, if I can get him onto there, and then Thomas there, and then switch back to John. Ah, there we go. Creating some steps. Okay, we didn't make that jump. Get Thomas on the case. Oh, actually, no. <laughs> We're going to need Thomas. And 
and the same process repeated up here, I'm guessing. <sighs> Alright, now we need Thomas. John. Um. Okay, right. <laughs> There we go. Oh no! I hate it when that happens. Right, we can get Chris on there, but right, we need to wait until it gets to its highest point. Fantastic! We did it. Alright, now we need... No, 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 come back. We need Thomas on that. Great. Hmm, okay, alright now. Yeah. Same as before. Thomas. Thomas again. Now well, these levels are becoming quite time consuming. Thomas again. Or not. Gonna need John. Um. Oh. Let's get John up there. No, we need we need we need John. <laughs> This is going to work, trust me. Um. Hmm. Work this bit out. Because he can't jump high enough to get up either of these, so he's going to have to get on top of John. I hate it when my brain doesn't work. Is he taller? Oh, slightly. Oh, okay, hold on then. I'll get Thomas up here and then John down there and then Chris. Ah, there we go. Got there in the end. Oh. 
Oh, we're still going. Okay. 1.10. Right, let's investigate. John to the rescue. Da, 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 da. Where is his floating target? <laughs> Not in there. How are we gonna get how are we gonna get Thomas up there? Alright. Okay. Let's uh pull back a bit. Pop him on there. The silence is a measure of my concentration right now. Right, so he's gonna have to go down there. I just hope I haven't screwed this up by getting him permanently stuck down there. Could, oh man, I, please no. I've got it, I've got it. Perfect. Right, we're on to number two, so this is the end of this episode, but look out for the next episode of Thomas Was Alone Let's Play.